welcome to Melting Pot, the show where we talk about life in North America. My name is June Park. I was born in South Korea, but my family and I moved to the United States when I was 16. There are many immigrants from all over the world here. Over 45 million people living in the United States and Canada were born in a foreign country. That's a lot of people. And today, we're going to meet a few of them. My name is Nami Musali. Thank you for being our guest here at Melting Pot. Thank you. I was born in Damascus, Syria. How old were you when you moved to the US? When I came to the United States, I was 12 years old. And what was that like coming here as a 12-year-old boy? It was very different. I grew up in a small town, southern Damascus. What did you used to do for fun in Syria? I used to play a lot of soccer. What do you miss most about your home country? My mother, definitely. That's the number one thing, definitely. Spend a lot of time together. Well, thanks for being our guest here at Melting Pot. My name is Patricia de Oliveira. I am originally from Brazil. How old were you when you moved? When I moved to the United States, I was six years old. What was it like for your family to move to a new country? When we first moved to the United States, it was difficult, quite a culture shock. My parents didn't speak any English when they first moved here, and so I used to translate for them in the beginning, but as they took classes and learned English, that stopped. What languages do you speak? I speak both Portuguese and English now. What do your parents miss the most about their home country? The proximity of our family members. In Brazil, um, because there was a lot of family around, there's always picnics, parties, going to the beach. Have you been back to visit? I have not been back to visit yet. I would like to visit Brazil very soon. My name is Rolando Carrera. I was born in uh, Chihuahua, Mexico. It's the northern area of the country. When you were a kid, what did you used to do for fun? Most of the time, I have to say that I used to listen to music in English. I used to listen to records over and over and over. What did you used to do for work in Mexico? I used to work for a record company. What was it like moving to the United States? In the beginning, it was difficult not to be able to communicate and talk to people and make yourself understood. And so I felt um, frustrated a lot of times. But once my English improved, I was able to communicate better. What do you miss most about your home country? Besides my family, the food. The food is amazing in Mexico. It's very colorful. Well, thank you for being our guest here on Melting Pot. You're very welcome. Welcome to our show. Thank you. What is your name? Mihoko Hakata. I'm from Tokyo, Japan. How long have you been in the United States? Um, it's been about eight years. I went to school in New York City. I used to study art, and now I go to school in Boston. What do you miss most about your home country? I miss this place called Shonan. There's a beach and many restaurants also. Well, thank you for being our guest on Melting Pot. Thank you. So many people, so many stories. Maybe you're wondering about me. What I remember most about Korea is the food my grandmother used to make, yukgaejang. It's shredded beef in spicy broth. Yummy. Mmm. This is pretty good, but not quite as good as my grandmother's. Hers is still the best. And that's our show. This is June Park reporting from Melting Pot.